So good morning, everybody. Uh, today, I handle this uh, subject name 19 CS 402 and database management system and second year, fourth semester. And unit number one, introduction to database and topic number four, view of the data and data model. We go for next one. So view of the data, why it is important? It refers that how the database is actually stored in your database and what data and structures of data used by the database for the data. And so describe all this database provider, uh, user with a view and there are, based on your conditions, data abstractions and instance of scheme. This is a, a process in your uh, database uh, store in your area. So this is data abstractions. So uh, you like example, uh, for example, you are uh, like a mm, uh, tube of your medicine. Um, all ingredients are uh, mixed up and inside into that uh, tube. Uh, what uh, ingredients are mixed up, I don't know. So same process is, is called as uh, data abstractions. For example, this is a user program, only is blank. So inside our process, private name and string inside uh, integer in integer public and public based on get ID and set ID. These objects. So data abstractions as a store with very complex data structure and uh, <coughs> uh, and um, uh, user come and want to access any data. He will not able to access the data if he has goes through a data structure. It simplifies interaction with user and database and DBMS hides some information uh, which is not user of interest based on data uh, called data abstraction. So developers hide the complexity of user and store the abstraction of view of data. This is a, a database uh, has a three level of abstractions. One is a, a level, level, internal level, logic level and conceptual level and a view level or external uh, level. This is a view level, a logical level, construction level, and internal schema. This is a database. This is called level of uh, data abstractions. Okay, we go for next one. So what is physical level? Uh, this is a, a lowest level of the data abstractions, which will describe how the data is actually stored in your database. And logic level, the data, next level abstraction describe what data can store and database. A relation existing among those data. And view level, in the level user only interact with your database and complexity remain unview. Users see in data and there are many, maybe many views of one data like a chart or group. This is a, a three levels of your sector. So break. So different data type model in your uh, database management system, uh, like uh, entity relationship model and relation model, object-based model and semi-structured data model, network model and hierarchy model. We have uh, totally uh, six models, uh, six different type of models are available in your process. So this is evaluation of data model and uh, starting from 1960 and ending of 2000 plus. First, by file base, second, hierarchical method, third, network method, next, relation model and entity relation model, um, object oriented model, last one, web based model in your database, mo database uh, model in the sectors. So, first one, entity relationship, this is called ER model, a consists of collection of uh, basic object, it is called entity. For example, we have a store in information is college and related to uh, uh, the student information related to the college and also student based on ID, name and address and college based on college ID, college name. Uh, for example, you take Anna University, for example, uh, you, we have, uh, I think, uh, 525 colleges in uh, in uh, all over India, all over Tamil Nadu in, in belongs to Anna University. So particularly if you want uh, process and you are a particular identify your college name, college student means based on first college ID number and year and department code and register number of the particular student. This is a basic condition and for an university. Or suppose in college, suppose so, uh, for example, uh, college ID number 
and particular year batch of student and uh, department for example computer science computer science technology computer science uh, uh, design or uh, mechanical engineer mechatronics engineer or uh, triple department or ec department this is a basic condition to identify your student and particular based on your college level and student level and student id number name and address this is uh, related to with the entity relationship to our sector so relation model it is a model can use of collection of table uh, to represent both uh, data and relationship among those data and uh, its record and database model and each table contains record based on fields and attributes so for example this is a relationship for example key mark the mark related to the uh, particular student in the sectors so object database model it a uh, model can be seen ex extending er model uh, with, with the notation of encapsulation functions and objective in, in the identity so this is object data model once uh, we have maintains a report object 1 and this object 2 so object 1 data activity code uh, route number daily production daily production equipment hours and lab hours so this uh, once uh, uh, related to the object means Active code, you can mention active code, active name, production unit, average daily production rate based on the conditions. This is semi structured uh, data model uh, permit the specific data uh, where individual uh, data item and of uh, same data type and uh, different set of attributes. And uh, example XML, uh, XML and uh, extensible markup language in the sectors. So uh, this is a uh, uh, Structure, semi structure model in our sector. This is a network model. It is a advantage, structure oriented, uh, data independence, and consequent simplicity, easy to design. Disadvantage is a lack of structure independent. This is a, a structure oriented uh, data model. This is a hierarchical based on its tree structure format and advantage simple, easy to update, and design and simple, database security. And efficiency and in disadvantages impl implementation complexity and difficult to manage in the sector this is an example of employee and permanent contract intern and permanent manager software engineer contract uh, daily wages member one and two intern uh, is a in, in training period of uh, minimum uh, three months to six months So this is the evolution part. Uh, uh, first one, advantage of data model. And second one, disadvantage of uh, data model. If any of you, please tell the answer. That's correct. So this is my references. And